About three weeks away from the WHS Crusade for Children, and it's definitely going to be one for the books. Like so many events this year, the pandemic has changed the way that we're fundraising for children with special needs across Kentucky and Indiana. As you may know, our local firefighters raise more than half of what comes in every year, but many departments won't be accepting your donations in person. That means no roadblocks for some, luncheons and dinners are canceled, even the Crusade's annual variety show has been replaced with the best of of collage of performances throughout the years. A weekend that usually brings in around $5 million, now an unknown as to what this year's total will be. I am so anxious about what this year is going to look like because going into it, we know the needs are so great because we've had over $13 million in requests for grants this year. So these agencies are seeing a need probably greater than they have in previous years. And so it wakes me up at night thinking, how will August 8th and 9th turn out? Um, and will we be able to help as many agencies, schools, and hospitals that we normally do? Everyone who's a part of the WHS Crusade for Children has brainstormed for weeks on how to fundraise with the new safety guidelines, and each fire department has its own plans. The easiest way is to donate online. If you want to help us out, you can text the word Crusade to 502 582 7290. We're going to send you a link to the Crusade website, and there you'll find the fire department toolkit. It's a big red button. You can send your donations there.